Welcome back to Singer Dad Reacts. My name is Josh, and I'm actually here for a, a new artist reaction. Uh, so this is one you guys have been requesting for a while that I've seen in many comments. Um, and that is Ginger, the song Pisces, the, the live version. So I'm excited to to see her. It looks like she's a rocker, so uh, kind of like uh, Fleur uh, Janssen. So uh, I'm looking forward to seeing what she can do here. I haven't done a ton of research. I, I'm kind of leaning toward not doing that going forward with my first time reactions, just so I can get a fresh take on the artist. Um, I just find that that's better. And then afterward, after that first reaction, then I go back and do a little more research and dig into their background and things like that. Um, so here are the lyrics. We'll go through these real quick. So verse one, step forward and meet a new sunrise. A coward is shivering inside. Today I'll be a friend of mine who swallows suffering with a smile. I drew a different reality with unconditional loyalty. Ego hardly can be peaked because I'm selfless. Scale armor blaze. This must be the, this is the course. Virgin innocence. One being brings life. Another runs for death. Scale armor blaze, virgin innocence, one being brings life, another runs for death. No promises I ever give, don't rely on me and I won't deceive. The beginning or the end you can't tell. When I wave my fin and shake my tail, I grew in different normality with unblameable morality. Hooks and nets are there for me, but I'm skittish. So then the chorus repeats. Third verse, Neptune's child shivering inside, drowns in the liquid gold. Cherish his life to the underworld. Meet me flashing when winter cries. And then the outro. Pisces swimming through the river all their life against the stream, searching for a hook to catch on and see their sunbeam, then suffocate in painful tortures. Wow. On cutting tables of callous men under a knife of handsome butchers. Emeralds are ripped away. And then it repeats. Interesting. There's a lot of symbolism, a lot of kind of um, alluding to Pisces, uh, which deals with fish. I understand the the actual zodiac sign. Um, there's several references to that in here that kind of draws in this imagery. Cherished his life to the underworld. Meet me flashing when winter cries. I like this line, who swallows suffering with a, with smile, with a smile. I drew a different reality with unconditional loyalty. I'm selfless. So I think it's all about kind of, you know, overcoming this kind of tendency that we have to kind of focus around ourselves and to kind of focus outward and to stand on our own and be unique and independent and cherished his life yeah so making the most out of life right yeah so that's my take on it looks like there's a little bit of a cynicism in there with especially that final little uh zinger there where it's like on cutting tables of callous men under a knife of handsome butchers, right? There's probably a story behind some of these lyrics. Um, but anyway, I'll move on. So part of what's been a challenge for me that I want to just mention real quick, and it's part of the delay in putting out more content, is my whole microphone situation. Um, I've really had a lot uh, of issues with microphones. Um, I finally got this one somewhat working. I, I think it's going to be okay, but um, I've just had ongoing issues with mics and um, with humming and with getting the right volume levels and um, things like that. So if any of you are audio video experts out there and kind of know how things work and what I can do with OBS and things like that on a kind of a technical level, uh, any comments you can kind of shoot me links to videos or or give me some insights or feedback or suggestions uh, kind of a different request there 
as far as suggestions go, but uh, be very helpful. This mic here is a USB mic. So the other one I had before when I did my reactions was a condenser mic. Um, and so it had its own share of problems. And I think it's because I didn't have a phantom power um, connected to it. So I'm still learning, but uh, trying to get the settings correct in uh, in OBS. And um, yeah, so let's move on to the reaction. Thank you for your ongoing support of my channel. And for those of you new, if you could please click on the subscribe and the notification bell to be notified of any new ginger reactions or any others you may be interested in, I would appreciate it. Also, if you'd like to support my channel, um, you can go to patreon.com slash singer dad reacts. And there's some really cool things. I'm starting to upload a lot more content out there. Um, so I have a little special behind the scenes thing um, that I have uploaded. And then I have some of my um, blocked and and extra reactions for original artists and things like that that I'm starting to post out there. So I uh, look forward to seeing you there. Thank you. She's got this kind of like rock sound. You know that when people sing rock, they have kind of this da 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 da. You know, this kind of um, it's kind of a, a pacing. It's kind of a the way that they inflect the words. It, it's yeah, it's hard to explain, but you know what I'm talking about. Probably it's kind of that rock vibe. Um, what's a good artist I could kind of uh, compare to that would give you kind of any of the ones like Joan Jett, Pat Benatar um, even like Hart probably if you kind of listen to their music and the way that they approach the, the lyric and the the rhythms and the, the surges with the, the way that they sing it and the phrasing um she's got that definitely and you can hear that this is just she's not even uh, you know testing her voice of course at this point so but she's got a really good tone i can tell already just from these early notes that she's got a really a lot of power behind her instrument and she can do a lot of things with it i'm sure just by the fact that she sings with such ease and um yeah, so I'm excited to hear what she's going to do here. Okay. Wow. Was not expecting that at all. Wow. Okay. 
what is she how is she doing that with her voice that's that's interesting it's like this low kind of guttural it's almost like the personification of vocal fry that she's doing with her voice but it's like such a low kind of I wonder what kind of effects they use on the with the microphone itself if you guys could kind of comment on that um, if that's what she's producing right there is all her own voice or if there's some effect on the mic that kind of creates that that kind of uh, growl lower growl type sound if you could comment on that I'd appreciate it because uh, if she's creating that on her own then that's something completely different right I mean we've we've I've done a lot of reactions to female singers on my channel where they can do whistle and stuff like that where they're going kind of the opposite end of the spectrum right where they're going super high by doing certain things with their vocal cords but this is entirely different and so for a girl um, to make the lower sounds they need to make the vocal cords kind of thicker and, and shorter um, and kind of apply a ton of error I'm sure behind it to get the to get that vibration to get the right um, low sound to it so that's wow that's cool was not expecting that at all <laughs> if she can go high too hopefully she shows some of that side of her range figure out like I said if it's some effect because I did see him hit a pedal like usually it changes the effect on the instrument you're playing but it could be that that pedal is also attuned to her mic so it kind of causes her mic to to change or distort the sound coming out of her voice so I don't know if that's what's going on here but even if that's the case she still has to change kind of the way that she's approaching the the vocal and part of what I was trying to see there I'm going to rewind a little bit to check it is kind of the positioning of her larynx so that that usually tells us a lot as well um, as far as what could be going on with her voice um, it's not always like it doesn't always equate to if she's going low the the larynx will be low because it could be also that in order for her to distort the sound the way that she needs to, she has to raise it a little bit. Um, yeah, it's not as straightforward as that. So, but I'm just curious to know where it's at. So let me rewind a little bit and see if I can get a good look at it. It's harder with girls because the, you can't see; they don't, you know, have the Adam's apple type thing that that men do that you can easily see where it's at. But let me see if I can. It looks like it's still pretty low, it's like right here. I like the guitar on this 
If you were watching this and you weren't like, you didn't know who was singing, you would think that the other was a completely different vocalist. Yeah, so I was not expecting that. Um, wow. That was... <laughs> that was intense. Um, yeah, she's definitely got a unique instrument. And that she can do that kind of... Do that that growl with her voice and her voice is not like raspy like one of the things i would guess if if someone was doing this a lot was that they might hurt their voice or make it you know kind of hoarse um because you're kind of like just like if you go to like a football game and you yell a lot or something like that and you're kind of raising your voice or changing the way that you're projecting it you know, your voice gets tired and, and hoarse. Um, if someone were to do what she's doing and not do it correctly, then that would definitely happen with your voice. But again, it kind of comes back to my Nightwish reaction I did and the romantic side and stuff like that, right? Where if you know how to project and you know how to put air behind it and, and not, you know, do it in a bad way, then it's not going to affect your voice in a negative way. And I was, I, it, it was cool that she kind of went and did some of the higher notes on the end there too, because I, I mentioned that earlier, that I wanted to kind of see her do some of those higher notes, and um, so I'm glad she did that. I mean, it's, it sounds like she's got a, a really good tone to her voice, um, a nice rock tone. So yeah, it's, that was definitely a surprise, and. Uh, Again, it's it's all about kind of Tengri is the same type of uh, is the same type of thing, right? Um, hearing his style, which was completely unique, um, I, I love to hear different artists and and what they do with their voice, which is completely unique um, in a lot of cases. And because um, I'm learning in the process, it's just like now I'm going to kind of like probably go out and research a little bit to see, okay, what is she doing with her voice and um, how is she producing that sound and things like that so I can kind of better understand it vocally because it is new to me as far as kind of you know understanding what what needs to take place for someone to create that sound healthily right and I could probably produce th that sound to some degree um, but if I didn't do it properly then it, like I said it would just you know make me hoarse uh, but yeah that was cool so if you have any other uh, ginger performances that you want to suggest for me to react to, that'd be great. Or any other similar artists with a really unique uh, style. Um, I do love those with like the powerhouse vocals. 
Uh, those are the ones I really love to kind of discover and, and listen to. So that, just kind of keep that in mind as well. Um, and like I said, if you haven't already, if you could please uh, subscribe and uh, check out my Patreon. I also have Facebook, uh, which I updated my username on Facebook, which I, don't, I hadn't done yet. I had forgotten to do. So now you should be able to just go to uh, facebook.com slash singerdadreacts and it'll come right up. I'll have the the link in the description, the updated link. And then my uh, Patreon, which I mentioned, and also Instagram, same thing, Singer Dad Reacts. So again, thank you for your support. I hope you're all doing well and uh, you're happy, healthy, and spending quality time with your loved ones and family. And take care. <laughs>